Hi there, my name is Sundas and I'm a member of the Data School's 33rd cohort at the Information Lab. Today I'll be showing you how to use a filter action field in your calculations. Let's jump into Tableau and get started. So the filter action we'll be doing today is creating a drill down action on the profit by state chart when you select a state. So let's begin. You will need to drag in our breakdown sheet as we'd like it. So let's try that again. There we go. And then we will need to go to our dashboards, actions, and then create a filter action. Here we would want to select our source sheet. And in this case, that will be the profit sheet. So we leave everything, um, we untick everything except for the profit sheet. And then again, we pick our target sheet. So we unselect everything except for the breakdown sheet. I want to leave it on menu to run the action because I want to give control to the user as to when they should see the drill down. I also want to exclude all values so that I can collapse the chart when it's not in use. And then we click OK. And then again, we click OK. So here we have our filter action. Just to make that a little better, let's go back and rename our filter action to breakdown. and then click OK. So now when we apply the breakdown sheet, this should show up and when you click off, it should draw down. The other step I want to do is to remove the breakdown. So now we want to create a calculation for our title. So we can create our title here title breakdown as I've already created it. This will consist of if our action, remember you can drag in your action field from the page. So control, drag and then insert. If our action is true, then I would like to see breakdown. And if not, I would like to see nothing. Bear in mind to put a space between your quotations. And then we want to end our calculation. And then here, I want to bring it down into our text. So if you just drag it from here, into your text. Then you can format it however you'd like. In this case, I would want it to be in the top left and I want to make it a little bit bigger so we're able to see. And then now I want to drag in my new sheet in between the breakdown sheet that will be drilling up and down and my other sheets on the chart. Here, I'm going to hide my title and again, hide my title. Now I want to edit height to 50, just so it's more visible. Now here, what should happen is when I click on my breakdown, the chart should pop up. When I click off it, everything should disappear except for what's already on the dashboard. Thank you for tuning in and watching this video. I hope you now feel confident in using the filter actions within your calculations. And I hope you subscribe to this channel. Goodbye.